Okay, so we're gonna draw an icosahedron. And an icosahedron is a 20-sided figure and it's um, 20 equilateral triangles. So uh, you're going to first find the middle of your page. So coming across, this is nine, so four and a half. Um, this is 12, so six, and you find your middle. Again, I have my compass on three inches. So my radius will be three, my diameter, my diameter is six. And draw your circle. Okay. You're gonna again find your north and south. So that'll be over four and a half again. And over four and a half so that you've got this nice even um, through the middle there. And then we're going to do what we did with the, um, the octahedron. So the cosahedron um, is also com can come out of the octahedron. So you've got your hexagon that you're going to make and then you're gonna make your equilateral triangle. So let's make our hexagon. And then the equilateral triangle inside. Okay, and then the next thing is that we want to bisect these lines and we learn how to bisect when um, you open your compass a little bit more and you make arcs and you have two points and but it's much easier for this because all we'll have to do is for the midpoint on this side is we line up these two points the middle and this side it'll give us the midpoint And then same with this one, we're gonna line up this point with the middle point. And then for the bottom, we have these two points because we line them up so nicely. So now we've uh, have we've bisected this line. So we found the midpoint, we found the midpoint, and we found the midpoint. And so we're gonna connect these midpoints. All right, so, and then to make the icosahedron, the last thing we need to do is connect those midpoints out. So now we'll shade, we're going to put um, how many faces and vertices on the bottom and put a beautiful title of what it is. All right, there we go.